Coming up on Via TV News tonight at 8, Pakistani police say a bomb targeting their forces guarding a Sufi shrine in Lahore killed at least eight people with many more wounded. Among the dead are civilians, police officers, and a security guard. After the New York Times released details on how President Trump lost roughly $1 billion in the 1980s and 90s, more than nearly any other American, Trump took to Twitter to defend his approach, saying his use of tax shelters was, quote, a sport. As the world celebrates his 150th birth anniversary, New York Congresswoman Carolyn Maloney expects Mahatma Gandhi to be honored this year posthumously with the Congressional Gold Medal, America's highest civilian award. And global digital payment network MasterCard says they will invest $1 billion in India over the next five years, roughly one-third of which will be spent to set up a local payment processing center. Those stories, all the news tonight at 8. Join us.